welcome to my channel. I hope you're doing amazingly well. If you're new here, I'm Roxanne. I film beauty videos, fashion videos, general life vlogs, and all that good stuff. So hit that subscribe button, and it's amazing if you can support my channel. And obviously, if you're not new here, and you're one of my OGs, hello! Thank you for returning. It's amazing. I actually was going to do a hair tutorial today, but I'm kind of feeling this like messy, poofy thing that I've got going on. So I actually thought I would do a bit more of a chatty video. I'm just going to put some makeup on. I've got about 20 minutes, maybe even less now. No, 20 minutes until my next work call and I was stupid. I was like, I'm going to film on my lunch break. It's 20 to 1 at the moment. Happy Tuesday. Um, it's 20 to 1. I was meant to take my lunch break at 12 and then I started overworking because I got really into something, which is normally what I do, which is not great. And then I've kind of missed 40 minutes of my lunch break to actually do my filming and to eat. So, hmm, I'm going to have to kind of like make it up later on. Well, uh, I'll eat as I go. But anyway, today we're going to be doing a kind of like a quick, just a quick chatty makeup video but also i wanted to talk to you about something i've been super super interested in at the moment and that is law of attraction manifestation of your dreams and goals and i have just found that it's completely switched my mindset also before we get started how cute is this t-shirt it says bloom mood i got it from asos for like £12 I think it was and I think it's just super cute but anyway it's already on my Instagram if you're following me on Instagram which you should please do um, I'll link it here and you'll see here or here whichever way I like to put it when I edit my videos but anyway let's just get started with the makeup because I have just wasting time I'm just going to go in with my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer just to cover my acne scars I've got a mirror there so if I look that way that's why. Because I was originally going to do a hair tutorial and then I sat here in front of my camera and I thought I just don't want to. <laughs> so I will do the hair tutorial that I was originally going to do probably later on in another video. But I just thought I would talk to you about the law of attraction and manifestation. I've been watching a load of different videos on this lately, just like TED Talks and inspirational talks about how... I can't remember what her name was, I think it was Sarah Plout, but I could be really incorrect. And she said in her video that 98% of people when they are on their deathbed have so many regrets. And it's really hit home to me because obviously because of COVID-19, obviously we're in lockdown. It's really opened my eyes to how much I appreciate certain things and also it's made me realise how much I want to do with my life. I'm now going to go in my NARS Tinted Glow Booster. I use the shade Medium. I love this. This is great for like an everyday dewy glow look. But yeah, as I was saying, 98% of people on their deathbed have a load of life regrets, things that they wish that they did. And I just don't want to be like that. Like, I just, I just want to live my life. And when it comes to my time, I feel like I have, obviously no one knows, you know, the date that they're going to die. I, as a morbid way of saying things. But I just think that it's, super important that you don't have regrets like I don't want to have regrets I don't want to get so old and think oh I wish I did that with my life so I've just started looking at how I can manifest positive thoughts and vibes and all of that into my life and I just think this the law of attraction is just so intriguing and um, I've just set out a load of different goals that I want to achieve which I will share with you some of them, not all of them, because some of them are really personal, but for me, like for instance, when it comes to my YouTube channel, my manifestation, my goal is to achieve 5,000 subscribers by the end of June, and I'm really going to try my hardest to manifest that to happen, like I'm going to try my hardest to obviously put so much positivity out into the world, and I'm hoping that I can achieve that, I will achieve that, it's about switching up your mindset it probably sounds a bit kooky like I don't know I know a lot of people obviously really believe in it 
and then there's obviously some people that probably don't but I do think there is something in switching up your mindset to make things happen for you I'm just going to go in with my MAC Cosmetics Give Me Sun face powder so I've just been really thinking about that lately and thinking about my long term ambitions my long term ambition is to buy my dream home I want to buy my dream home by the year 2022 that is my ambition and I have a long way to go but I'm thinking that is my one of my big end goals and to, one of the ways that I can achieve that is by creating more side hustles like another form of wealth and I think for me obviously I have my day job but I really want to be earning more on YouTube and doing more with my channel and content that I create and obviously it's been a hobby for me for so long but obviously this has all made me realise that there's more that I want, there's more I want in life and I think that there is more that I can get out of life and not just settle, I just don't want to settle anymore. And now I'm just going to go in with my Hyper Real Glow face highlighter palette it's beautiful by the way i'll link above the review for this amazing the, re the review is amazing it's my video but this is amazing so that's what i've been really thinking and I, I don't know if any of you have thought about this or you've started doing any research into this or you've lived by this by having positive affirmations obviously i have po positive affirmations every morning but i think there is more to it i think it's really good to have positive affirmations but i think unless you truly believe in those affirmations then things are not going to happen for you unless you truly believe in yourself and what can happen for you what you can make happen for you that makes sense. I'm really on it. Like I, I, I was doing so much research on it yesterday, and I called my little brother because obviously I always do when I have these ideas in my head. I kind of immediately call Ryan. I'm like, Ryan, we're doing this. This is the plan. <laughs> um, this is what I want to achieve for my family. Blah blah blah. To be fair, I call Ryan more because I, he doesn't judge me at all. I'm just going to do with my NARS blusher palette. This is the unfiltered palette. Just adding a bit of colour to my cheeks. One, because he doesn't judge me. I hope everyone has that. Like, obviously Gary doesn't judge me, but there are some crazy ideas that I have. I just can call Ryan and be like, listen to this. <laughs> listen to this crap that I'm spilling out of my mouth. Um, and there's never any judgement. There's never any, you're so weird, or like, so kooky, or what are you even talking about? Um, and not that Gary would do that because he's not like that, but so I like to so I like to just have Ryan's thoughts and opinions because he's my brother, and I I just get that we get the creativeness flowing. But he was like, there's someone that at his old work, or no, there was someone at his work that manifested her dream house, which has got obviously one of my end goals. It's one that I want to achieve, and. The way that I said that we need, I need to do that is to have monthly goals that will achieve my long-term goal at the end. So obviously one of my monthly goals is to obviously achieve 5,000 subscribers by the end of June and that is like a really big ambition but the reason I want to achieve that is because that is a massive milestone for me. It also enables me to work with brands and obviously because my subscriber rate is higher um, I'll be earning more money off YouTube and that sort of thing and I think that will then help me save and earn me more income alongside my day job that will essentially help me buy a house if that makes sense so I just find that it's I just find it really fascinating like it really really fascinates me and I just think I've seen it work for so many people and I just hope that it works for me like it will work for me <laughs> it's really hard to differentiate I hope it works there's always a slight negative in it, I hope to it will work for me this is what I'm going to do I'm going to do it I'm going to achieve it, I'm going to achieve my dreams and goals and, and all these ambitions that I have. It's just amazing, like that change in mindset, but it makes me feel so much lighter and so much more full of energy and so excited about it. I'm just going to go in with my Pillow Talk lipstick. I'm not going to add any mascara because I'm in the house and 
To be fair, the only reason I've done my makeup today is because we're on a chin work. This video probably makes absolutely no sense. Oh, but I hope it does. I really, really hope it does. And I'd be really interested to understand like what your thoughts are on law of attraction, positive manifestation. Obviously, I think law of attraction is what you put out into the world and what you attract back. That is my perception of what that means. Whether it's your dream girl, dream boy, or whether it's your um, dream job, or you want to earn more money, you want to be wealthy, you want a dream home, or like what is it? Like what is your dream? And then what are you going to put out into the world? What positive affirmations? What ambitions are you going to have? What are you going to work towards to help you achieve that? And then every day say to yourself, I can do this, I'm doing this, I will achieve that. I just find it really, really fascinating and refreshing and I think because there's so much negativity, everywhere you look there's so much negativity and I think there is just something in the whole I can do this, I will make this happen for me, I will support my family, I will achieve this for my family, I will have my dream home that has a cute fireplace and a utility room. <laughs> do you know what I mean? I think there's something in that mindset that shift that you need to have to obviously get what you want to and i wonder if any you know which i'm sure they do all of these really successful people they must have it's it's i doubt it's just by pot luck that they've achieved what they've achieved like it's hard work and ambition but it's also a belief that you you can i don't know I'm just waffly, I'm just waffly today because I'm just so excited to talk about it and hopefully it makes some sense but I'm, I want to continue this on and I will do more research and I will link below um, the few things that I've been reading and watching lately that's really got me excited about this but yeah, I, I will share, I've got to check the time I've got like four minutes <laughs> until my call so I'm going to have to go but Thank you so much for listening to me waffle waffle on. This is the makeup look, it's really really just standard but this is more about just living your dream right? So I hope you enjoyed this video, I love you guys lots, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up because that all helps me achieve my goals <laughs> um, and I'll see you in my next video, bye!